What's going on guys, Barber CVO in the building, baby. We are back from Tennessee. It's a beautiful, beautiful hot day here, Tuesday in Georgia. Can't beat the weather here, man. It, it feels like summer all year round. So if you guys ever wanna move to Pooler, there's a lot of houses around Pooler that, uh, that definitely got a for sale, so come check it out. I already got a subscriber that moved out here. Shout out to my boy, Aaron. Um, he came all the way from Colorado and uh, he just moved in my same neighborhood um, last month. And he was like, oh, you know, um, we saw your videos. We saw your videos and, uh, and definitely wanted to move out here and check it out. Next month, he was here already. So pull the trigger, guys. Best way to live out here. Definitely should have done this a long time ago. But anyways, this video is definitely about uh, a seat that I have that I borrowed from Bootleggers Harley. And uh, like I said, I will be back over there next month. So they lend me the seat. I just wanted to try it out, see how it was. It's a seat from Harley Davidson. And what's it called? It's Harley Davidson Road Zeppelin. Wow, the Road Zeppelin. Man, let me tell you something about this seat. I drove, I rode about 470 miles back home. Look at this, I'm sweating. 470 miles back home with my wife on the, on the Road Zeppelin from Harley Davidson. Wow, this has got to be the most comfortable seat ever. I mean, I wouldn't use it every day. I would definitely just buy it just if you're going to go on a road trip to like Sturgis or Daytona or New Hampshire or across uh, across the country. Um, highly, highly recommend it. I, I, I've had so many seats uh, with my with my uh, with my bike, but definitely recommend it. Um, I, it's a demo seat. I actually borrowed it from them. And uh, let me tell you guys, it is definitely, definitely worth it. Worth it, worth it, worth it. I'm gonna show you guys real quick. Okay, so here is the seat. Man, this thing is the widest seat I have ever seen. Ever, ever seen. Definitely the widest seat. Look at this thing. Check it out. It's called the Harley Davidson Road Zeppelin. It's a demo seat, super comfortable. It has positions here. I didn't hook it up because I didn't, I didn't have the time to, but these uh, buttons are actually give you comfortable. Um, it will squeeze you in here, squeeze you over here and lift your butt up. And the passenger also has one too as well. Super soft, my wife loved it. She couldn't believe it. She was super, super excited. Didn't complain not once about the, did not complain once about, about the seat. Oh, excuse me. Did not complain once about the seat. And let me tell you, this seat is definitely good. Look-wise, I'm not sure if I like it to keep it on every day, but definitely I would pop that puppy on if um, I was going on a road trip for sure, 100%. Don't matter how it looks. Comfortability overlooks definitely all day. All right, check it out. Very, very nice. Harley-Davidson Road Zeppelin. Pretty cool. I'm gonna show you guys the tape measure, what it what it measures from side to side. So we're looking at probably 21 and a half from side to side. Deep wise, about 18. And with the passenger, oh I can't get it. But anyways, it's pretty it's pretty long, pretty big. Definitely recommend it. I also wanted to show you guys also, my wife is five feet tall. She has the seat right here. Obviously we had the tour pack over there on, I just took it off. But there was a problem as far as how, whether you, if you have a wife that's like really short, I was thinking, oh my God, what can I do? Because for some reason she wasn't reaching the pedals, the, the passenger pegs. And uh, for some reason I had to think something real quick because, um, she wasn't reaching and she was kind of getting annoyed and I was like, you know what? While this is why you're on the road always thinking, always thinking, always thinking. What happened was I took off my highway pegs that were here and I decided to put it there. I'm not saying this is like a, a permanent thing, but it was definitely worth an emergency, um, an emergency thing that she could because her feet were actually like around right here. And then the, the floorboard is right here. So she was dangling. And I know she was constantly moving, constantly moving because she couldn't uh, she couldn't reach the, the, the pedal. 
So what I did was I took the, the one from over here and I took the opposite side and then I moved it here. So she was super happy, super good. She, with no complaints, her foot was actually like literally just like that, as I would put mine. Comfortable, comfortable, comfortable. So if you don't, if you are on a budget, you don't want to spend 300 something dollars at Hardy to buy the pegs um, that they come, because I know they come right here, right on top of this. But I was like, damn, I don't want to spend 350 bucks. So I thought of something and I did this. So all you short wives, on an emergency road trip, put them on there. You guys can see how it looks when you're in position. So, road sofa, can't even see it when you're, uh, when you're um, sitting on the seat. Come from behind over here and check out the scenery, how it looks from the back. So people can just capture it, see what it looks like. Very cool. Very nice. All right, so like I said, it's very comfortable. It doesn't bother my hips. It does bring you up a little bit. As you can see on my tippy toes, I'm five, eight and a half. And I like my tippy toes, all right? The little arms in the All right, guys, so like I said, if you're in the market for one of these seats on a road trip, big time, big time road trip, definitely check it out. Um, get a, go get a demo. You won't regret it. Check it out, all right? Thank you guys for watching. Short video here on this review on the seat, the Road Zeppelin. 470 miles from Tennessee to Savannah, Georgia. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you guys subscribe if you want more video, all right? Thank you guys. Peace.